All right, today we've got the Legion RDA. I don't know if this is made by Vapor Superman. Um, I'm not sure who makes this. Um, I did buy this from a website, um, sunshinevapes.com. Uh, the shipping was quick, price was cheap, I have not opened this yet, so this is my first look at it. Um, so let's see what this thing's all about. Allen wrench, extra O-rings, the atomizer, and looks to be about it. Got a nice 510 connector on it. Nice gear pattern, some sharp edges. Top screws off. Nice threading. Flat top. Nice. For any of those that don't like the copper coming in contact with their juice, it is stainless steel on the inside. See if I can get this gun off of here. Nice tight O ring. Not the biggest airflow I've seen, but it is interesting that the airflow moves up, which some people believe gives you more airflow. And you can, looks like, close it off. Um, interesting. You could do some interesting things with the airflow, it looks like. Definitely interesting. Now, on to the deck. The center post. Does not free turn. Let's see. Kind of interesting. I don't know if you can see that. Let's see if I can get it on camera here. One side, the screws go all the way through, and on the other side, they only go about halfway. I have to see what's going on with that when I build it. It's got a nice big hole for the center post, which it needs, because supposedly you can do up to 12 coils on this. So... The outer posts are milled into the deck. 
It's got a really deep juice well on it. I don't know if you can see that in the video or not, but it's that's a really deep juice well. Really tall posts. I'm just not too sure if there's enough airflow. You've got the big posts with lots of holes to put lots of coils in there. And then just these two little tiny air holes. Doesn't look like there's any way to get more air. I don't know. Well, I'm going to clean it up and I'll put some coils in it and I'll come back and I'll vape it for you.